Our short visit to dead Moscow, the phantom of the past, is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies a populated station, the theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the red plane. Yeah, I wonder if such a bad thing today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Well, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. Boss is busy now. Wait here, please. So, that's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is fitting distance to Polis. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through. And you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here, huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome, and have a good rest. Forever. had a thing for me. Is it when did you come back? He told me all So Nikitish, when do we become your own father? Well, good one. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the theater. Hey, you! Stop! Show me your tickets! Did you hear Oh, <laughs> sure. Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room.
Artyom! No, enjoy the show! Sorry, man. Time to move on, you patron of the art. Pressing the audience, my full shot. So glad to see you. Where have you been? You don't like Helen, no, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah. 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 Artyom? Artyom? Looks like... Ah, well, yes, yes, it's a hard life without a... Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but, uh... Let's drink to the fact we are still alive, huh? It's on me, okay? Here you are, do a special. Been infusing it for half a year. Opa! That's great! So, let's drink, Artyom! Фу! А! Хорошо прошла. Smooth stuff, а? Huh? And this is a good place, but... Uh, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro, and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there. There's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Wow. So, <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true, but no beggars either. Another drink! And now, to equality! Come on, Artyom! No, 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 no! Pay that now! Ooh, хорошо прошла! Ah, where was I? Ah, uh, yes! Yes, look, look at the far stations! They freaking eat each other! Sell their kids at slaves, it's like the Stone Age! Left to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order! is all that matters. That's, that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Блин. Come on, Artyom, come on! Bottoms up! Bottoms up! So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. Ready? It is, Private. was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, just you wait, and we'll get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Hey, stop that, blyat! It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I... Think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. Sir. The Secretary General here? What about Comrade Corbin? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need information. So, my advice to you, my friend? 
cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us. Artyom. Good day, Comrade General. Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky. You're one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lunium must start learning how to improve his uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! Huh? Oh. Fuck! Still nothing, huh? <laughs> okay, okay, bitch! You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat! Passwords, code names, operation protocols! What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonia. Interrogation! Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastards! And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my son! Oh, I must agree with Leon. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not 
be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the dark one? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Fuck Corbett! Fuck my father! And Morozov! And the revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father! Killing his own brother! Listen, if you get out of here... Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom! Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood... Sit down, Corbett. Let's talk. About the negotiations in Polis? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence, after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damned refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans! The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right?! I'm... Moscovin. When you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But... Corbett, is this whole fucking Metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the police. A frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground to the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbett. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesniski bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target. So that's the one you cut. 
Who's there? Shit. Either my ears gone bad. I want them all. Commander, we're not Nazis. Shooting is one thing, but we can't burn people alive. What do you mean? People? Shooting? Are you out of it? Aren't you talking about the refugees? What refugees? Let the special department handle them. I... <laughs> Wait, on the double. Yes, sir.
Did you accept the delivery and sign the manifest? I sure did. Where did you put the truth? Specific? Specific? Wherever I left the ladder. Hey, what the hell was that? Going to stand here much longer. Yeah. We should be careful. Did you ever do what you did there? Yeah. The station's nearby. There's a machine gun, searchlight, a combat around. And something rustles in the cobwebs and the sound just feels. <laughs> Why not burn those whips? We do that the time. That was no fucking spider. I know. Looked like a human with a large bag at that. But when I lit the place up, that was enough.
Stay down, or your brain goes splat. Wait a minute. Artyom, is it you? I was able to send the report back to the Order via my old acquaintance, Andrew the Blacksmith. At least Miller will know that I am alive, that I haven't completed the mission, but haven't resigned from it either. That's one serious pickle you're in. But I can help. I have friends, and they have friends, who can relay everything you tell me to your guys from the Order. So, now you must return home to Polis? Well, there's no direct route. Everything's cordoned off here. But I believe the Order has an outpost nearby. On the surface, the church in the marshes. Try that place. If we can get word to your people, they might meet you. As for me, I started life anew, left Kuznetsky most. The Reds completely subverted the place, looking for traitors and spies, sending people to camps, or just shooting them, all because of the coming war. People are fleeing from Kuznetsky most and their whole Red Line. Well, we built something too, with the stuff the refugees... Here. Take a look. At this baby, the boys even gave her a name. You can't help but fall in love with her. She did a swell job running refugees. But hell, you can't save everyone. So, take it. We have people in Venice, too. When you get there, find Woodpecker and tell him where you left our baby. Come on, climb aboard. All right, start the engine. We're still tinkering with her, so the controls aren't perfect. But the lights are first class. No need to fear the spider bugs around her. And there's a lot of those in the far tunnels. You should go. It's a long way.
Pavel's group is advancing towards Tretikovskaya, also known as Venice. They have a few hours lead on me and are moving via frequently used tunnels. But I will catch up. I can't afford not to. We're armed. We are armed! Swear by Lenin's name. He doesn't look like a GB. I don't recognize the uniform. Could he be one of ours? Look at all his weapons. Don't shoot! We are civilians! There are women and children here. Leave and let leave, okay? We're refugees from the Red Line. I'm in charge here, basically. No, there's nobody under my command. All the battle-worthy men went with the other caravan. Half a click ahead. I thought they'd protect us, but they were attacked. We heard the shooting. It subsided. But it doesn't look like our people survived. So we can't go any further. And if we go back, it's the firing spot for us. You look like you've seen your share of fights. Can you help us? It's not for me, but I pity the children. So what do we do now? How do we live without them? They might still be alive. Don't bury them yet. Are 
Thanks. Thanks, man. I thought... I thought I was done for. It took everyone still alive. The kids, the women. I'll move the rail car so that you can drive through. If you follow them, be careful in the technical top. Thank you again. I'll just... What about the guy? Nothing so far. What's taking him so long? It's a piece of cake. Fuck. 
are surely taking a time. Pretty soon. There's the bitch! Going where? 
What the fuck is up with you? To guard you. And if we let just one snitch they bite, hit.
you can tell me the tale later. We're entering the fairway and plotting a course to the base. The snow on the surface starts melting. The familiar rail cars are now joined with boats and fishermen. One of them appeared just in the nick of time. Soon we'll be docked at Venice. Pavel is most probably already there. I don't usually fish in this tunnel, but I had a hunch they'd be biting pretty good here. Square in the red line. I saw a boat coming in from there today. Mm, some serious dudes. No refugees. Stay quiet now. They don't like noise. And this is their world. See how they just rested? Nobody knows what they mutated from. We call them shrimps. Ooh, ugly as hell. Eating, especially with beer.
Oh, wow. This doesn't happen often. Looks like we lucked out. The subterranean Venice, an island on the dark waters of underground rivers. You always hear rough stories circulating about this place. I hear it is all one huge den of thieves. But there is something I know for sure. Pavel reached Venice, and if I'm not late, he's still here. Finding the Dark One is still my main mission. But now I see I must also uncover Corbett's plans so that I can warn the Order about them. The local fish, huh? Aren't they charming? Mm, seemed moody, though. Looks like somebody went through there before us and angered them. Open up! The fishermen are back from the seas! Yeah, I see you all right. And who might that be? I think the guy up in the tunnel. You don't think I should... What? And make my life easy? Of course not. First is reds, now this, what is this? And I keep raising a lower the gate. You can bring a girl for once. And what would you do with one if I brought her, Zemanovich, huh? You're way too old for that stuff. By the way, you better lower the gate. Or else a woman might actually come. The one dressed in black and bearing a scythe. <laughs> Never fear. Semyonovich is going to outlive you all. How's fishing? Not even a bite, unless you count the shrimps. And they got a few more out of me than I'd like. I was saved by this lad, aren't you? Thanks for your help. So what exactly did happen? Shrimps were all over us as soon as we got to the fork. Almost took my raft apart. <sighs> what the hell gives? Oh, that's easy. The Reds passed through here, going to meet our esteemed neighbors. Didn't seem to care what they stirred up. Ah, so that's why. Look, Artyom, I suppose there is no hiding. Venice is full of gangsters. Jula, the scum of the earth. So don't you start any shit. I don't want any trouble. Simon! Hey! Simon! I want to talk to you. Look. Do you know where might our red guests be? In the brothel, of course. Who's that with you? This is Artyom, the scourge of the shrimps. <laughs> you should see him, sure. I never met anyone quite as good as him. A gunslinger, eh? Would you help me take out a few bad guys? Simon, I freaking knew it! This is getting old. But almost all of them are gathered at the storage facility. Look. If this isn't the right time, I don't know what is. Between the two of us, we might be able to take them out. I told you countless times already, and I'm going to tell you again. No! I don't need the shit around here! Do you get me? Yeah, I got you. Right. Then I'm going to leave you two. Okay. In a station of criminals, how is it he's in charge? Fish. Good fried or in broth, whichever you like most. Listen, bro. You know, do you have a bullet to spare? I wish we had more visitors like you here. Thank you. More caviar. Can't even look at this. Statement. 
So, did you take a look around? I have some business with you. Let's be frank. Seems like you're stuck here for good. Sunken tunnels everywhere. And if you go to Novokuznetskaya, you're as good as dead, probably. Seems like you're out of options. So, here's the deal. You could just stay here with us. You're young, tough, you can handle things, and we'll find you a job in no time. Especially since most of those newcomers here are just human refuse from Novokuznetskaya. Just think about it. You start working with our fishermen, get a bit acquainted with things, then you might actually like it here. We could even find you a nice girl. Well, I won't pressure you. Go get some rest for now, and try to stay out of trouble. The gangsters seem to be jumpy today. Beautiful. That's unusual. A new face! Hello! You're welcome. <laughs> Good stuff, ain't it? How about some bull? Here you are. <laughs> Good stuff, ain't it? How about some bull? Just calm down. Fresh meat nuggets. Great prices today. Come get your nuggets. What the fuck? Any guys? The fuck? The way real the man whatever you have look guys I got nothing the business is dead here business is dead you're the one who came here asked us for product well, I thought there'd be some, man well there is not so I'm going to take back our investment give me the merchandise and two clips interest two clips but the all right it's okay <laughs> all right hush baby hush what happened <laughs> I lost my teddy bear! Hush, baby. It's all right. We'll find your teddy bear. Don't cry. Where did you walk today? I wanted to show him the shooting range. And then I got yelled at and ran! The merchandise, Kazool. The rules are simple. You take position and kill all the critters. If you make it before the signal, you can collect your winnings. The targets are waiting. <laughs> I bet he's not hitting anything. Who's game? What's the bet? I shot him. Two to one. If he hits everything. I shot I'm even on yeah. three. Who cool. yeah. ain't hitting shit? All right. It's a deal. Trey, here's your winning. How about the race? Take position. And here are the sticky grenades. <laughs> That's he actually. Ah, anyone can get that. Let him hit once more. See that? He hit again. Dre, here's your winning. How about the race? Be my guest. Incendiaries. Get the It's 
like you put me in for three bottles. No way. Here, this is the next one. Hey, what's it now? Hit again? Ah, it's getting interesting now. Left. my day. That was something. Here's a special prize for you. The targets usually last till the evening. Mind. Well, our they barbecue is going to be bag. busy for I a while now. <laughs> My teddy bear! Mom, the teddy bear is back! Where have you been? Were the buttons good? Don't leave me again! Oh, thank you so much. I was at a loss. What should you say? This person helped your teddy bear come home, so what should you say? Thank you. Thank you. You're a godsend. Simon brought that teddy bear from the surface. Toys are scarce here, as you know. So he grew really fond of it. We go home now. Can I from your local boss, bitch. Sure. We don't have bosses here. Cough it up. Are you crazy? They're friends with Kisley. Are you sure? Great. It's for free and the this cat. All right, we had some fun. Now it's time for work. So. First thing, we pay Kinsley and you head it to Comrade Corbett. Tell him the virus container's been successfully delivered to Oktyabrska, okay? Hey, pretty boy. Why are you just standing up? It just don't feel right. We basically signed our death warrant. Can't wait to touch me, can you, Daragoy? Well, if you want it that bad... What kind of dance would you like, sweetie? Tell me, don't be shy. Make yourself... If you decide to come back, I'm always around. Where did you get all those pictures? Come get your nuggets! What station do you... What did you do?
You see that guy in the helmet? He gave us a case last time he was here, and Keithley sent it off to Arturskaya. Said he was full of flyers for the working people. Flyers, my ass! That case had a lock. So, what was in there? I wish I knew. Touching the filter now. Wait a minute, Spiria. What's this shit about the Gas mask filter. The mask is part of the of that, all right. That's bullshit. No need to spoil a good filter and make the guys make it. How do you think? You made sure nobody opened the package. Who do you think I am? Huh? We got a deal. Besides, who needs your power? Factory made. The real deal. The oil. I heard the freak show came to a What the fuck was that? It's nothing but bones and eyes. And that feeling in your skin. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my a glass of tea. Hands <laughs> behind your head. Well, 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 what an unexpected encounter. Looking for the dark one? Huh? Well, maybe there is a hope for you and police. But then, um, you're too late. Yeah. Those dark ones of yours are the real deal, yeah? Comrade Corbett had an eye on them for a long time. Just imagine them domesticated, then unleashed on the enemy. <laughs> hey, 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 steady, steady, steady now. All right, all right, you're on top, D'Artagnan, you are on top. What now? Uh, you were looking for the dark one, right? Well, he is nearby, at Oktyabrskaya. I can take you there. No tricks this time, you have my word. No! Shit! He got away! Why did you attack the storage alone? You could have tried to call me. Well, things worked out. But you'll have to get out of here on the double. I know an exit to the surface here. There's a swamp, but it's traversable. Let's go.
That's for the gangsters. 